My name is Paul Carter, and I own San Clemente Surfboards and Art, and I shape surfboards and do uh, abstract art and tropical art. Been shaping for 20 years. Basically, it was kind of evolved through growing up surfing. I started surfing when I was five. Just through the years I've been around uh, like Hobies and Infinity and a lot of different companies. And I was sponsored at the time and I've always had a fascination with uh, shaping surfboards. Steve Bainey, who's a master craftsman as well, he, uh, he of course is the shaper there, the main shaper at the time. And uh, one of the shapers uh, moved on and I asked him if he could teach me how to shape. And a month later, he said, okay. And that's kind of how I got started in just shaping the boards. It's, uh, it was kind of intimidating at first, but then as things um, went along, you know, you get better at it. You get better and you just keep dialing it in. And I just got better at it. My first experience with shaping a board was, uh, it was pretty exciting because I was learning a craft that I could actually make my own boards let alone make boards for everybody else and it was kind of exciting because i i love surfing so much you know, i was inspired to do it so i do i pretty much do everything that i'm inspired to do and uh you know especially the things that push me out of my comfort zone so shaping did that it is uh sculpting it's like a meditation when i go into the shaping room and and um just relax and cut it out and and um, I mean, there's been many times where I've thought about getting another job and all that stuff, but every time I go in there and shape a board, whether it's a quarter of the way into it or halfway through it, I'm re-stoked and I'm re-inspired and, and I really um, embrace it and just enjoy the process. Uh, I don't do drugs and don't do, you know, I'm not an alcoholic or anything like that. I just, um, through shaping I've discovered myself. Uh, it's taught me to let go. It's taught me to let go and really enjoy the moment. And uh, it's a not an easy thing to do. And to um, get to that place of uh, just letting go of ego and letting go of everything and just really getting into shaping. It's, it's taught me. The whole art of hand shaping is kind of becoming a lost art. It's um, with the advent of machines. I think all of the aspects of handmade, it just, it just makes me feel good to build something. There's something about, um, similar to painting, when you have a blank canvas and you do the outlines and you cut the, the blank out and it comes to life. There's, it's a, it's a um, whole creative aspect and you look at it when it's done, kind of like a painting and you, you just, for me, I just look at it and then go, wow, I made that. Uh, there's nothing like shaping your own board and going in the water and catching a wave and going down and flying on a, you know, a short board or nose riding on a long board. It's, I wouldn't want to have to choose between the two. So with all that combined, that's how shaping is to me. And that's what I love about it because it has so many options. As you'll see, when you, when you walk into a room, there'll be a hundred blanks and your, your mind will go everywhere because it's like going into a car lot <laughs> and you can pick out any car you want. Only difference is you got to make it. I built my business on one-on-one um, -on -one relationships. So as far as depending on the board, uh, uh, I specialize in custom boards. So it's a custom hot rod shop for surfboards. So people come in and they want a short board or a long board. I um, go over either a pre-existing board or I go over a board I have here. I think the mindset is really kind of researching and, and knowing in my mind what I'm going to shape before I go into the shaping room. So if it's a long board, the guy wants a performance nose rider, I already know in my mind what I'm going to do for that guy. You kind of have to prepare um, mentally before you go in. But I don't lose any sleep over it. You know, I just um, kind of go through and put a plan in my brain and I go in and do it. My name is Paul Carter. I'm a surfer shaper artist of San Clemente Surfboards and Art here in San Clemente, California.